Hello you guys, it's Shana Marie again. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome. Um, today we're going to be doing a full body HIIT type workout, 10 exercises, about 15 minutes. It's quick, it's fast, it'll get you a nice full body burn, um, and then we'll be done for today. So hopefully you have your mat ready, you have your shoes on, you have your space, and you're ready to go because we're going to get started right away. As always, remember to use modifications. Use them, use them, use them. Um, these are designed to either go deeper or take it back a little bit, so make sure you are moving with your level of fitness that you're at right now. Okay, so we're getting started right away. We are going to start in a plank position. These are called frog hops with knee taps. Um, so you're going to tap your right knee to your upper arm, left knee to upper arm, and then you're going to hop forward, lift your chest, hop back to plank, repeat. Okay? We got 15 of those just to start right off the bat. Plank pose, push the ground away, squeeze your belly, and tap right knee, left knee, hop, hop, right left, that's two. You shouldn't have to move your hands if you need to pick them up at the hop. That's totally reasonable. Four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, we got five more, and five, four, three, two, we're almost there, and one. Oh, we're readjusting for a moment. We're gonna move right along to forearm plank dips. So you're gonna come right down to a forearm plank. You can bring your hands together if you have tight shoulders, otherwise palms are gonna face the floor. Push your forearms down, come up to a forearm plank. We're gonna keep pushing our forearms down and rock to our right side and left side, okay? So we're dipping the hips down. Squeeze your belly at the top. So we're not gonna let our hips do this, right? We're gonna keep them nice and high, dip down. Okay, we have 30 of those. I'm going to bring my hands together because my shoulders are a bit tight today. So pushing the ground away. Ready, get set, and begin. Six, seven, keep breathing, eight, nine, 10, we got 30, 11, 12, 13, 14, squeeze your belly, 15, halfway, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and we have 10, 9, 8, push, 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 7, 6, 5, 4, keep breathing, 2, 3, 2, and 1, all right, back to center, bring your knees forward, Woo, that warmed up the core a little bit. All right, we're coming all the way down onto our backs, moving along nice and fast today. Okay, so most of you should be familiar with these. We got single-legged bridge lifts. So we're gonna start with our right leg up, kick that heel out, spread your toes towards your face, hands can come to the floor. We're gonna dig into that left heel and push up, squeeze your butt, and then back down, okay? Very simple. We got 15 each leg. Ready, get set, get in your position, and begin. Let's go one, two, three. Push down into that heel. Four, you really wanna get lifted. Squeeze your butt, five, six, seven, eight, over halfway, nine, squeeze, 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 10, let's go for five, Four, three, woo, two, and one. Now let's put our right leg down, second side. We're getting right into it. Ready, get set, and we get one, two, three, four, woo, five, six, seven, eight, nine, keep breathing, ten. Let's go for five, four, squeeze, 
squeeze your inner thighs. Three, make it count. Last two, two, and one. We're bringing it all the way back down. All right, and we're coming back up to a downward facing dog position or a pike position. So these are pretty simple. For a moment, I want you to come into a plank and just make sure that you're in the right um, length from your hands to your feet for a plank pose. And then just sink back to down dog if it looks right. All right, so push your hands down. So these are called sliding push-ups. What I want you to do is look in between your thumbs, slide forward as if you're coming to plank, but bend your elbows and come to a push-up, okay? It takes a little bit of concentration, but you're essentially just sliding yourself into a push-up rather than coming to plank and pushing down, okay? All right, this should hit a little bit of your triceps, biceps, everything good. All right, so we're gonna begin. I'm gonna shut up. All right, ready? Get set, we got 15 to 20 and begin. Let's see how far we can go. One, two, you can always put your knees down. Three, four, five, six, squeeze your belly. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, use that breath, 14, oh my arms, 15, I got my knees down, let's finish it strong, 5, 4, 3, 2, last one, Whew. and one. All right, good push, you guys. Okay, we're back to our seats. We're moving on to seated bicycles. So if you're not familiar with these, we're gonna come to a boat pose, lift your feet up, and you're gonna bicycle forward. And then halfway, we're gonna bicycle back. If you want to, as a modification, take your fingertips behind you, okay? I'm gonna try to keep my hands up, We'll see how that goes. All right, I'm gonna start my timer. And getting on your butts, get ready, lift your feet up. We're gonna start in five, four, three, two, and one. Bike forward. Fast knees. Keep breathing. Keep biking. Lift your chest, squeeze your belly. Maybe lean back a little bit more. Test yourself here. Can you lean back a little bit more and squeeze that belly? Okay, all right. And we're gonna reverse in five, four, three, two, and one. Reverse, bike backwards. These are a little bit harder on the quads, so you can put your fingertips down. I'm gonna put my fingers down for these ones. Squeeze your belly. Try not to rely on your fingertips too much. Keep moving. We're almost there. We got 10 more seconds. And we're stopping in five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Okay. All right, moving on to our next one. We got some toe squats. These are super fun. So, coming to standing. Come to a squat position, so feet about hip distance apart. You probably want them to be a little bit narrow. So make sure they're either hip distance or even a little bit closer. All right, I'm gonna turn to my side so you can see. You're gonna pick your heels up so you're on the balls of your feet. Your knees should be bent. Bring your arms in front of you and we're gonna squat down, kind of like a sissy squat, but today we're just gonna squat normally, okay? We're not leaning back. That's one, keep squeezing your inner thighs and your butt. Two, this should be a booty workout and a quad workout, so really squeeze, okay? We got 20. All right, raise up those heels, fingertips forward, lengthen your arms, squeeze your butt, squeeze your inner thighs, nice and tight. Ready, get set, begin. One, squeeze your butt. Two, don't lose balance. Three, keep reaching forward. If this is too much, do a normal squat. Four, 
five, squeeze your butt, lean back, six, seven, whoo, eight, my legs are already screaming, nine, ten, we're halfway there, eleven, whoo, twelve, thirteen, whoo, fourteen, squeeze your butt, fifteen, whoo, relax those shoulders, sixteen, seventeen, 18, two more, make it count. 19 and 20. Woo, nice, you guys. Okay, we're moving on to dolphin push ups. So, coming back to downward facing dog, we're gonna do some one legged dolphin push ups today. So, I want you to come to your down dog and then just lower your forearms to the ground. Okay, again, you can keep your forearms as so with your palms facing down, or we're gonna clasp our, palm, our hands together, okay? These are gonna be a little bit more accessible. All right, I'm gonna keep my palms down for this one, and I'm gonna breathe my right leg to the sky. All right, so squeeze your inner thighs. We're gonna look at our thumbs and dive our nose towards them, okay? We got 15, or 10 each leg, my apologies. Ready, set, and begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oof, my hands are sliding, eight, nine, and ten, switching legs, left leg up, one, two, three, four, five, keep breathing, lift that leg, six, seven, eight, Nine and ten. Ooh. All right. And we're moving along all the way to our backs. We got three more exercises, you guys. Let's push through. Okay. These are called cross roll ups. All right. Coming all the way down into your backs. Bring your legs forward. Take your arms onto your sides. Relax your shoulders. Squeeze your inner thighs together. Turn your toes up. All right, we're gonna curl ourselves up. You might need a little push and tap our left foot with our, our right foot with our left hand. And then slowly roll back down and roll up. Right hand, left foot, okay? All right, we have 30, okay? 20 to 30, we're gonna try for 30. All right, ready? Get set and begin. Let's go one, two, three, four, whoo, five. For those of you with booties, these are a little bit harder. Six, keeps you off the ground a little bit more. Seven, it's harder to roll up. Use that core. Eight, nine, let's go forward. Ten, eleven, whoo. 12, 13, 14, 15, whoo, these are getting harder, 16, 17, cross over, 18, cross, 19, 20, can we go for 10? and sit back deeper, and you're gonna pulse in and out, okay? Knee knockers, okay? You're squeezing your inner thighs. All right, you got one minute. So come into your squat. 
Let's get ready. Get set. And five, four, three, two, and one. Squeeze your belly in. Knock your knees in. Really squeeze those inner thighs. We got this. These should be a nice leg burner. And we are almost there. Actually, we still got like 40 seconds. So we're not almost there. We're about a third there. Okay. All right, we got 30 seconds left here. Keep sitting, keep knocking those knees in. In, in. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Ooh, I'm feeling it already. My legs are screaming. All right, we got 15 more seconds here. Push through, knock them in. Keep breathing. And we're stopping. In five, four, three, two, and one. My thighs. Okay, our last exercise today. We are moving on to kick ups. So don't worry about the height. If you want to face a wall, go for it. Um, we're going to start with one leg down, hands on the floor, look in between your thumbs. You're going to keep this leg nice and bent. Keep your top leg really, really straight and strong. And you're just going to hop up, hop, hop. Okay? All right. We got, how many do we got? 15 each side. All right, ready? Get set, squeeze your inner thighs, and begin. One, these are kind of like a handstand prep. Two, three, four, five, six, whew, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, oh, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Switch legs. All right, right side. Ready? Get set and begin. Let's go on. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, we're almost there. Thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Whoo! Whoo! All right. Nice job, you guys. That's it. That's our hand workout for today. Um, hopefully this gave you guys a nice little burner. If you need more, do it again, right? All right, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe if you wanna see more HIIT workouts. I also have yoga flows, some tutorials, um, and lots of fun stuff here. So subscribe if you wanna see more of that. Otherwise, hopefully I will see you in the next video. Woo! Good job.